So you gotta hear this one. Perfect story. Woman calls up, first time homeowner, just moved out of the city. She's got comfort issues in the home. She's got cold spots. She's got a laundry list of problems. She's probably thinking that she needs a new system. Usually we go in there with proper testing and checking out the home. We can actually figure out what's going on. And then we can make the proper assessments of what she's actually going to need. She might not need a new system, but maybe she might. So we're gonna head out there right now. And once we do that, then we'll be able to figure out what the problems are. So I took a look at their system. The system seems to be working fine. We, we really feel that there's other underlying issues in this home that, that are just not showing themselves. So what we're going to do is we're gonna hook up a blower door. As we've done, we set this up in the door here and we're gonna depressurize the home. By depressurizing the home, we're sucking all the air out of the home. And that's gonna help tell us where all the leaks are. So we're gonna take a walk around now while this is running and we're gonna see where all those problems are. Take a look at this. See all that dark purple right there? That's showing you the leaks. We got a floor surface temperature of 53.4 degrees. You've never been in there? I mean, you walk in here barefoot, your feet are gonna be freezing. I bet you there's a crawl space under here that's probably open to the outside. Let's go downstairs and take a look. So, so now we're getting somewhere. We found some other smaller problems, but this is a big one. An vented crawl space to the outside. That's a below that kitchen area. This is what's gonna kill the floor surface temperatures upstairs. There's insulation, as you can see inside here, is all falling down. It's vented to the outside. It's gonna make that kitchen floor feel like it's the outside. I think we found all the problems. The guys are gonna spend some time here today, seal up all the problems, and we're gonna come back later and see how they did. We're back. First place we're gonna start off and take a look to see how the guys did is the crawl space downstairs in the basement. After our diagnostic in the morning, we came to find out she doesn't need a new system. She actually gonna be very happy to hear that. What we did today was we put silver glow up on the walls, we fastened it to the walls, we put clean space on the floor, we brought those liners up and we secured them to the walls. We also then spray foamed all the rim joists in that whole area and secured that down to the silver glow so we have no air leakage whatsoever. Wow, 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 I can't believe it. But look at these floor surface temperatures right now, we've got almost a 15 degree difference. It's amazing. The homeowner, when she gets home today, she is going to be so happy. So after a few simple fixes in the home, we're going to reduce her energy bills. We're going to take away all the comfort issues in all the rooms. We're gonna stop her pipes from freezing. And the kicker of it all is that her systems are now going to last longer. She thought she was gonna to have to replace her systems. Her systems are fine. Now the system's gonna last longer. Why is it gonna last longer? Because it doesn't have to work as hard. Because now the home is more energy efficient. 